looking back at my preliminary task and comparing it to my now opening sequence, I feel I've progressed a huge amount, especially in the terms of my camera work and my editing. I think if I compare these two shots, you can see in the first the camera work is jumpy and doesn't match up. The character walks past the same piece of the wall twice, um, which is an obvious continuity mistake. Whereas in my opening sequence, the editing is much more continuous and you almost can't notice the shot change unless you're looking for it. This is an example of how I progress from my preliminary task to my opening sequence. Also in the preliminary task, the angles and the shot types used are all quite basic and don't really add much to the overall storyline. These were issues I tried to address when editing in my opening sequence. I tried to apply all the continuity techniques I learnt during the preliminary task to my opening. as And as these were learnt during the preliminary task, it was a lot easier to stick to them, as I was more aware of how this was done. I used the match on match action in my preliminary task and in my opening sequence, and again this was much easier after using it the first time to practice, as it came really naturally to use it. The continuity techniques I have used when filming and editing I feel are the real means for creating meaning for the viewer, as if the continuity is bad and the shots don't match up the viewer is likely to become lost and not really pay attention or enjoy the film, whereas if the continuity is done really well the viewer doesn't notice this. All of these skills I feel I have developed from my preliminary task to my opening sequence.